All right, uh, what's going on, guys? Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to Terabyte Reacts, and today we're jumping into some more NF real music, right? That's what we're doing. <laughs> okay. Anyways, man, this is another one of NF tracks. The next one on the list, up to bat, is real real that is the name of the track we're gonna be watching the music video along this one has some caption on it some lyrics hopefully they're the right lyrics i'm gonna be listening okay so with no further ado i'm loving the journey so far nf is one of those rappers man that you can't help but fall in love with the dude you know what i'm saying fall in love with the music man you can't help yourself. And to anybody that's out there saying that this music is too depressing and all this other stuff, you need to wake up. You need to wake up. Or this just ain't for you. This just ain't for you. If you think that NF's music is depressing, where well, I think his, his music is very uplifting. His music, the reason why his music is so uplifting and it's different Reason being, and I think the mo the most profound reason why is because NF, the stature that he is, being, in my opinion, one of the best in the game right now, one of the best, in my opinion, to ever do it. And I've only listened to like four songs, and I'm telling you, this guy, as I get more and more as I get in into his music, I can see that he's going to be up there on my list okay so just goes to show you that's how you got to take it he's talking about things that he's been through in his life that you can relate to right and also understand that he's not you know what i'm saying he's not um t a, a, a terrible person he also has accomplished things he's also successful so that goes to show you you know what I'm saying? A lot of successful people out here killing themselves. And this guy is putting everything out in his music. This is his outlet. I'm letting you know that you're not alone. Okay? So let's jump into some NF Real Man. Hear what he has to say on this track. I'm ready. I hope you're ready. Let's go get it. Are you ready? I know I am. All right. Real music. Mm -hmm. Real music. Yeah. <laughs> Yo. Yeah. Just getting that, just getting that headspace. You know. Ooh. Will somebody get the body bags? Wig them with the beats in them now. Put the MCs in them. Season them. Put them on a beat with me, then I'm eating them. Get away from the table, you rappers ain't. Is he getting in his Eminem bag? Is he getting in his Eminem bag for this one? Ooh, let's bring that back a bit. Let's bring that back. Let's bring that back. He just said, put him on the beat with me. I'm going to eat him. <laughs> oh, my God. Let's get it, man. Oh, my getting God. That, you're getting that headspace. You know? So he's ready. Will somebody get the body bags? We're going with the beats in them now. Put the MCs in them. Season them. Put them on a beat with me, then I'm eating them. Get away from the table. You rappers ain't hungry enough. You Woo! rappers ain't hungry like ass. They talk about me like I'm here. They talk about you like you was. A nurse came into my room. She told me I'm sick in the head. Oh, yeah. Hospital bed with a bed and a pen and a press on my neck. Mm. I'm never leaving. Why? I am as ill as it gets. Any rapper that said that they run in the game, I'm a coming in session and cut off their legs. <laughs> Any rapper who thinks that they run in the session, I'ma come in the booth, I'ma cut off your legs, homie. Let's get it, man. Talk your ish NF. Let's get it. They run in the game, I'ma come in the session and cut off their legs. Strap a grenade in my head, pull out the pen. My music is mind blowing. Nobody do it like I do. Come on. These bars, bro. Oh my god. Pull out the pen. 
It says strap a grenade to my head. Pull out the pin. I'm, my lyrics is mind blowing. I don't doubt it, bro. <laughs> I don't doubt hey, it, man. Let's get it. Pull out the pin. My music is mind blowing. Mm. Ain't nobody do it like I do it. You ain't no, gonna they be don't. Like I'm gonna pull them with the wedding. Keep on talking and acting like everybody gonna get it. Better sleep with your eyes open. Mm. You wanna know what I know? This look around in my fan base and they ready. Yes, we do. That mouth reference. You say I don't know who your dentist is. To read on the internet, I do not know who your dentist is, but he should clean out your mouth. Don't call me a seller, that's something I don't know who your dentist is, but he should clean out your mouth. Don't call me a sellout, that's something I've never been. I mean, that could be a clean, that could be a clean bar. That could be a clean bar. But I'm kind of reading something else into that bar. Could be, could be he's talking about, you know, all these rappers that they cuss in their music. It could be that. You know what I'm saying? It could be referring to that because he doesn't cuss in his music. Never been. I've been through hell in my life, though. But I know what heaven is. Father, forgive me for I am a sinner, but you gave me music as medicine. Woo and nobody want to problem when I get in my zone, but it leave me be. I'm a mean MC. Better feed me rappers or feed me beats. Ah. Feed me both of them. They like me. Hey, bruh. Who's that from again? Feed me rappers or feed me beats? Somebody said that. I'm trying to remember who is who that line is from. This is the first time I heard that. It is not the first time I heard that. I know I've heard that line before. Feed me rappers or feed me beats. Um, somebody has said that before. I don't know who I heard that from before, but I know I've heard it before. Or maybe it's in reference to something else. I don't know. You guys can let me know in the comment section who said this before or something similar. Feed me both of them. They like, nay, what's it like to be famous? Um, I'll let you know if I make it. Yeah, I wonder what life would be like if I didn't stick up my neck. $200 inside of my bank account. Woo! I was living on that. I need some Ooh. money to pay for my rent. I need mm. some money to pay for my cash. I'm yes. not complaining, I'm just being honest. I promise that I want to pay for respect. No. Never. I get so frustrated. Take a look at what I created. Time is wasting. I ain't waiting. I'm a doctor with no job. Me, I don't have no patience. I keep pacing. Back and forth, I keep racing. You ain't never been in my book and I got a problem with it. Why? Because you're wrecking like you read my pages. Mm. line in the song so far i don't care what you guys say i don't care i know i got got about a minute left to listen off this but dude i'm telling you right now this is the realest line in this song right here if god isn't real real isn't bro that is a hard bar right there Oh my God, that bar hit hard. I got goosebumps off of that bar, man. That bar is ridiculous. Oh my God, if God ain't real, real isn't. Okay, real isn't real if God ain't real. <laughs> oh my God. Let's get it, man. Let's get it, man. NF, you too nice, bro. You too nice. Pull that back a bit. Let's get it. I'm feeling it. You don't like it to deal with it. And if God ain't real, real is it. Mm. So I why I existed. I exist in a world that's real different. Yes, and sir. What you when you grow up, man. I doubt they will get it. My life is a mess, but watch your step and you step in it. Some of this brain is off limits. I'm off in the world you don't get. Cause you ain't never been in it in 10 minutes. I still couldn't explain what's inside my brain. Don't mess 
with it. I've invested a lot of me inside these lines. I'm just protecting them. Everybody want to hit a real version of life. They don't get so sensitive when I say something a little bit raw. I drop my thoughts and they call it negative. You want to know where my heart is? I stand out because I wear my garbage. I work my hardest. And every time I look into the mirror, I don't forget about where I started. Oh. Mm. Bruh. Tell me what am I doing here? Tell me what am I doing here? Tell me what am I, what am I doing? Mm. Tell me what am I doing here? I said what am I doing here? Tell me what am I doing here if I'm not being real? Mm. Straight up, man. Straight up, I respect that. <laughs> All right, no, you know, ads right now. Anyways, I don't want to have this in my background. <laughs> I'm gonna take no i can't take it off right now anyways guys that was the video of course um of nf you can i'm not sponsoring sprite <laughs> okay anyways man that was a deep 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 music man basically what am i doing here if i'm not being real i love that message i love that message nf i love that message and he totally totally brought the bars for this one no doubt about it um he had a lot of lot of um he definitely on this track he reminds me of he reminds me of something that m would do and i'm not you know what i'm saying like when it comes on to um as i said before like a lot of times when it comes on to i'm, I'm not saying or in comparison and i'm baffling my words like crazy right now um because in turn i don't want to um be comparing him to m because they're they're coming from two totally not totally different angles in in its entirety but they're very similar to me you get what i'm saying they're very similar kind of artists to me where as in they just know um where the impact is they know where to use the hammer to hit the nail on the head of what their fans want to hear from them as a artist eminem missed it a couple of times but he got back on track <laughs> you know what i'm saying like even though i say that you know revival wasn't his worst you know it wasn't his worst songs by any means you know what i'm saying but you know people you know totally destroyed him for that and he came back with kamikaze and was like <laughs> y'all thought i still you thought i couldn't rap you thought i lost it nah <laughs> bruh you know what i'm saying but that's what i'm saying like he gave a lot in this song he gave a lot of that vibe of listen guys i could be out here doing what you do you get what i'm saying i could do what you do which is you know what i'm saying pander basically it's pretty much what most artists do you know what i'm saying that's what most artists do most artists you guys might not know this but in the music industry most artists don't get to do what they want to do they get told what to do it's now that that you find that not most of them a very minimal part of of music is independent you get what I'm saying? Which they're coming to understand that nowadays in this age of social media and stuff like that, you really don't need a record label to blow up. That's why we have this age of mumble rappers. <laughs> okay? That's why you have so many of these mumble rappers that don't know what the hell they're doing. Right? And you have the, these record labels that they sign these guys these mumble rappers and they put them out there and they give them a good beat and they'll say some words man they're gonna love you all we got to do is put you in the music with her you sipping lean 
You know what I'm saying? And we put a bunch of gold chains around your neck and they're going to be like, oh, I want to aspire to be this guy. That's what's going on. Right? Right? So when it comes on to, to you have a lot of people that are coming from, you know, big record labels, although a lot of them still get supported by big record labels, they go out and they start their own labels, you know, i.e., um, Eminem. Eminem has his own label, but he's still um, with um, Interscope, right? So he has that big backing, but at the same time, if any artist has like creative freedom, it's 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 Eminem. There's a lot more out there. Like Jay Z has his own record label now, and all of this other stuff. Like a lot of them, they don't. You get what I'm saying? Like Jay Z has Rock Nation, and it's a lot of different stuff that is out there that we might not be privy to but i'm telling you you can see just by examining on what's really going on with the industry today that you are happy some when when for 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 capital to be doing this with nf that's huge because it's obvious that nf has creative freedom no doubt about it because i'm telling you I am telling you right now, if he didn't, he wouldn't be putting out this kind of music. I'm telling you. He probably wouldn't sign with them. <laughs> you get what I'm saying? He probably would not sign with them because NF is just that real, right? And he has a higher purpose than just being with any record label. I think NF is the type of artist that could have blew up without a big backing because his, his message is so powerful. His message is so unique. You get what I'm saying? So I think he could have blew up without, you know, a big record company behind him. I think he could have. Um, I do think that these big record companies do need to give their artists a lot more creative freedom now. And it it's kind of what's happening. Like you can see that some of these artists, you know what I'm saying? Like you can you can know when they're being driven instead of you, instead of them actually driving the car. You know what I'm saying? If you understand that. It's just it's just cool to see a, a guy that can express himself like this in, in the music industry without without um without being penalized. But that you know what I'm saying? Like he could do this and I know that there's a lot of I don't wanna go look up, you know, pieces you know what I'm saying? Like, I don't want to go look up um, articles and stuff like that on him. Because I know there's people out there that's, that probably do not like NF music a lot. Because no matter what you do, you're going to have haters. But you just got to do you. And that's what I'm, that's what he's telling you. He's like, I'm different, my guy. I'm different. There's nothing wrong with you being different. Take the message for what it is. That's what he's trying to tell you. It's like, you're different. You don't have to be like everybody else, man. You don't have to be like everybody else. Why am I here if I'm not going to be real? Why am I here if I'm not going to be real? That message is powerful, guys. Um, and as I, I, and as I said, man, the hardest bar, the hardest bar in this song was when he said, if God isn't real, then real isn't. Okay? So take it for what it is. That's just what I I believe in that a hundred percent, a hundred percent. Thank you guys so much for tuning in once again, man. Thank you guys. I'm gonna try to see if I can get out one more song for today. I have some more reactions that I have to do for today, but I'm gonna try to get out one more of NF song today. I don't remember what the song, the next song is on the list, but I'm gonna try to get that done also in my next reaction. So look out for that one. I don't know what it is. As I said, I don't I don't know the list, so I have to keep checking the list. Um, to see what I'm supposed to do next the journey so far man doing these in order has been incredible I can see You know one song leading to the next I also catch the references back to the older songs too um, I think it was in intro two. Um, also in, in intro two. You know he referenced a lot of the, the the songs that I already reacted to and I went back to look at it I was like, okay, we we'll see um um, we saw, um, I think it was therapy session and, um, another song in there was, I, I know you referred intro one. Um, also, 
he ref he talked about mansion um he was also talking about f- the, the stuff in his mind so his journey is incredible i'm out <laughs> thank you guys so much for tuning in as always keep the good energy up man nf is a beast a lyrical beast okay so thank you guys so much man for tuning in as always i say this so many times when i'm trying to close out my videos so just get used to it because gratitude we we can't run out of it okay i will thank you guys until forever comes whatever (laughs) okay i love telling people thanks man i love telling people thanks gratitude is is such a lost thing on today's society people don't like to say thanks and i love to do it because it makes people feel different it makes them feel like there's hope okay so i love to i I thank you guys because without you guys basically this channel will be nothing so thank you guys for subscribing for the nf journey if you are here for the nf journey man there's other things that i'm planning to react to when it comes on to music i'm just kind of taking my time to kind of you know gravitate into that into those things so thank you guys so much for tuning in once again it's more time about reacts man and i'm out i'm not a sponsor for, for sprite I, even though i would love one if you sprite if you're watching i would love a sponsor man <laughs> anyways guys thank you guys so much for tuning in once again i'm out peace